Hi, my name is Gunnar Sletta. I'm a senior developer here at Qt Software. I'm um, here today to talk about uh, some of the performance benefits that we've been uh, working on for Qt 4.5. For instance, um, for this release we took uh, Qrect and tore it apart and put it back together again in such a way that um, basically all of the set operations, intersects, contains and everything uh, is significantly faster. Another area where we did some uh, pretty drastic improvements uh, is the way that repaints are handled in Qt. We did a lot of work there to basically lower the amount of time that is spent between the time when the user gets their paint events called. The EQ graphics view and, and friends classes um, also received quite a few optimizations where um, basically trying to minimize the amount of uh, arithmetic that has to happen before uh, before the items paint function is called that the amount of actual multiplications was reduced um, the amount of propagated matrices in child hierarchies and stuff has been had, had been um, simplified basically so that um, so that the amount of operations is significantly reduced and um, Finally, maybe the thing that I've been that I've been most involved with is the uh, is that we took the software graphic system that we have. Uh, it was more or less a a rewrite, at least of the of the infrastructure, if not the if not the content itself. And um, one of the things that we did there was to try to minimize the overhead. For instance, say that you're having a particle effect, and you um, you have uh, a thousand tiny pix maps that are being drizzling down your screen at uh, varying opacities um, and each pixel map is maybe like 8 by 8 pixels then, um, and you change the opacity for each draw image call then, then the dependency on changing the opacity would actually propagate into lots of different st state changes internally in, in the paint engines uh, which would actually be the major bottleneck in that, in that, uh, in that particle effect um, while the actual cost that you would expect to see would be to actually draw the images, right? But uh, we managed to iron out much of that overhead so that these state changes are as, uh, are as cheap as possible and that um, and the end result is that this particle effect would run on Qt 4.5 maybe 5 to 10 times faster than it would in Qt 4.4. The 4.5 release uh, was very much about a number of small performance enhancements in many different areas that should in the end result in, um, in that um, Qt applications simply run faster and smoother.